Hi there. Now with this question we're given this figure here which shows the finite region R bounded by the x-axis, the y-axis and the line x equals pi upon 2 and the curve with equation y equals sec of half x for values of x going between naught and pi upon 2 inclusive. Now given this table here which shows the corresponding values of x and y for y equals sec of a half x and in the first part a we've got to complete the table above giving the missing value of y to six decimal places and that's for one mark and then go on in part b to use the trapezium rule with all the values of y from the completed table to find an approximation for the area of r giving your answer to four decimal places and this is for three marks. So if you'd like to have a go at this question just give you a moment to pause the video and when you come back I'll take you slowly through the work solution. Okay welcome back then if you had a go. So first of all then we've got to put this value in here and all you've got to do then is just make sure your calculator's in radians mode and just do half of pi upon 3 which is going to be pi upon 6. We've got sec here which is 1 over cosine so do the cosine of pi over 6 as I say make sure your calculator's in radians mode and then just do the reciprocal of that 1 divided by it. So you should find your answer that you get then is 1.154701 okay to six decimal places. Now in part b it's using the trapezium rule then to work out this area of r and I'm assuming that you're familiar with the trapezium rule if not you can always check it out on my website but essentially what we're doing is splitting this region up into intervals of equal width and we can see that the first interval goes from 0 to pi upon 6 and then we've got another interval going from pi upon 6 to pi upon 3 something like that okay this is pi upon 6 this is pi upon 3 and what we're doing then is just approximating the area under the curve by straight lines like this and that formula then for the trapezium rule is that the area okay is roughly then we'll say area of r is roughly the same as half the width of a strip well you can see what the width of a strip is get it from here it's just pi upon 6 okay so it's half of the width of a strip and then it's always the first height which is this one here which goes from 0 to 1 so the first height is 1 plus twice the sum of all the middle heights that's these two in here so this height is this y value so it's 1.035 Two seven six, and to this we add the next height that's when x is pi upon 3 and we get this value 1.154701 and then we add the last height okay and the last height is this value here 1.414214 okay and uh, if we just close that bracket off okay working this out now okay you should find you get 1.778709 and so on and we're asked to give this to four decimal places so to four decimal places it's going to be 1.7787 okay you might even want to put units squared there because it is an area all right you're not going to get any extra marks for that but uh, there we go and that answers to four decimal places so remember then when it comes to the trapezium rule it is just 
half the width of a strip and then it's the first height plus twice the sum of all the middle heights plus then the last height and it's as simple as that.